Hello, everyone. have a custom Lego minifigure review from Citizen Breaking. I'll show you more of the videos. Click right up here, or links will be down below. We have some new minifigures from uh, CB's most recent releases. Uh, they are, um, they're not uh, new new. They're more of like remakes of some minifigures. So we have here the Cookie Pusher, which is the Girl Scout cookie seller. And she does have new uh, cookie boxes, I noticed, like different colors. And then I don't know if I, her, uh, some print might be different on her. So we'll look into that. And then we do have the uh, Scouting Enthusiast, which again is a, uh, a remake of the previous one. I think some of his badge colors are different, uh, and his face design might be a little different. Uh, and we do have new packaging here. We'll start with the Cookie Pusher. So we do have some new red packaging. Usually it's blue or that dark blue. They have done green for the uh, Botany Enthusiasts. But I do like the red. I opened the box and it just popped out right in front of me. So some nice detailing and then we do have the same spiel on the back of course links way down below i think these are still in stock and as always i open up my cb minifigs and i destroy the packaging <laughs> one day i'll have all these on display so let's get her out so we do have she does come with um some one by two cookie boxes let's put those on here And there we go. So these are on one by two smooth tiles, and they do say cookies on all the same. Uh, detailing on the boxes are the same. You can see little cookies flying around, but they are different colors. I think the previous ones, I know there was a green box. Uh, of course, you can connect these to Girl Scout cookies, so these ones would be Samoas, I know that. I think Tagalongs are red, uh, Thin Mints are green. Uh, I think the the like sugar dough ones or not not um the sourdough ones are blue i don't know what these ones are they have s'mores stuff like that um i know it's girl scout cookie season so this was a good time for this minifigure to come out pop those off and now on to the minifigure i also think she has a different face design and different hair from the previous one i might be wrong on that i know her print might be different though i don't have the figure right here i wish i i knew where it was in my drawers of figs but I don't so she only has one side to the face you can see a nice big smile little dimples in the cheeks eyebrows raised up she looks very happy and then we do have coming down to her chest and torso she's got her little Girl Scout vest on in that green color she does have a gold chain on with a dollar sign and then a uh, striped shirt on underneath you can see the light blue lines going across then we do have a lot of patches. There is a neutral face, a little Easter egg, I feel like. A little neutral face right there. We got, uh, like, be like a red cross one. There is a red and, uh, or a, a yellow and blue one. Kind of looks like the Ukraine flag. Uh, we do have a rainbow. A little gold tag right up here. She does have pockets on there. Or it could be more badge spots as well. That one kind of looks like a baseball. I know it's not, but different, uh, patches, of course, for when she completes stuff. And then no printing on her legs. These are the short legs. These aren't the opposable legs. And they're in green. I don't think I've ever seen them in green. Coming over to the side, no printing on the side of the arms, waist, or legs. Yellow hands to match the face. Same thing as this side. No printing on the side of the arms, body, or legs. Yellow hands. And actually there is no printing on the back. I'm surprised they could do that vest, uh, the scrunchy thing in the back that you can tighten or loosen the vest. Could have been something on the back of her. But nonetheless, a little happy new CB fig to add to the collection. And we can add her with the cookies. And of course, we can find my other Girl Scout. And they can sell some cookies in Lego City. So here are her... Oh, a little blurry. There we go. There you go. You can see her holding her cookies ready to go. I mean, even the Boy Scout maybe wants to buy some cookies. Set her off to the side. Here is the next minifigure. We have the Scout in, uh, Scouting Enthusiast. When CB released this one, I think it was last year of CB Day, maybe, I might be wrong. They had him, and then they had, I think they had a zombie one at the same time. I could be wrong getting my times mixed up, but I know they've done a zombie uh, scout, and they had scouts around at the same time. Again, red packaging, standard back, and as always, I open my minifigures. There we go. So, coming here to the minifigure, we do have a custom printed hat. This is a Lego hat. No, it's not zooming in. There we go. Oh, focus. There we go. Uh, you can see the red front with the gold little button on the front. Tan hat. This is a Lego hat. 
pop that off for a moment. You can see coming to his face. Uh, they look like freckles, so I'm going to go with freckles on his cheeks. He's got a big grin going, kind of has like a nervous look to his face. With the eyebrows at least. And then coming down to his chest and torso, we do have his little handkerchief on around his neck. Latched on with a nice little gold clasp. Uh, and then we do have his um, band going across with all his patches on there as well. Looks like some of the similar ones to the Girl Scout. He does have that yellow and gold, um, blue one. And then it looks like he has uh, that blue one with the red dot. Yep, that blue one with the red dot I think is one, maybe. Um, like I said, I don't have the one right next to me for comparison. But I know this one I think is different up here. I think on the previous one it was green. This one's blue. He has his tan long sleeve shirt on. You can see the buttons down the center. And he does have two pockets on underneath his band of um, badges. And then no printing on the waist or legs. These are dark tan legs. No printing on the side of the body. Yellow hands to match the face. No printing on the side of the arms, waist, or legs as well. These ones are pretty, sim um, pretty easy minifigs. This one does have back print, it looks like. So no printing on the side of the arms, body, waist, or legs. Yellow hands to match the face. Coming to the back, you can see his handkerchief hanging off the back. And then he does have his band of badges, the strap coming along. It's a sash, I think. I don't think it's called a sash for Boy Scouts, but uh, going across his body. And then no printing on the back of the waist or the legs. But another Boy Scout to add to the collection, and actually a Zombie Scout. These guns remind me of the movie um, Survival Scouts, the zombie one. That's actually a very underrated movie. You should check that out. Um, but some great new minifigures, again, with new packaging uh, is pretty cool. So uh, links will be down below. I do like the minifigures. I think I like the Girl Scout a little more because of the cookie boxes. I wish they just had cookie boxes. You could line the Lego stores with them. But nonetheless, pretty cool minifigures done very well, as always, by CB. So if you want to check them out, their links will be down below. If you want to check out my CB videos, click right up here. Our links will be down below as well. Be sure to leave a like if you haven't liked the video, and subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. And as always, thanks for watching.